Uh, hello everyone, uh, this is Amir Masood Kian Manish, presenter of this paper from University of Kashan, Kashan City, Iran. With cooperation, my friend and supervisor for preparing this paper, Dr. Ali Akhawan from Alburg University, Alburg City, Denmark. In this paper, I've investigated on real and reactive power control of grid connected inverter with optimized LCL filter using one cycle control method for a PV system. Contents of this uh, presentation that includes the following subjects respectively. Inter introduction uh, including reasons for using of filters advantages and disadvantages of LCL filter and its damping methods. Some control techniques for controlled VSI connected to the grid by LCL filter. Advantage and disadvantage of one of them. Designing an optimized LCL filter by an artificial intelligence technique named particle swarm optimization abbreviated PSO control grid connected inverter with LCL filter using one cycle control abbreviated OCC method including control the VSI inverter using OCC method control the resonance of the LCL filter control the reactive power using virtual inductance method optimal control of active and reactive powers and voltage compensation simulation results conclusions suggestions to continue this topic introduction reasons for using of filters the decrease of current harmonic around the switching frequency is an important requirement for VSA connected to the network. For this reason, passive filters are used. Passive filters including L filter, LC filter and LCL filters. Advantage of LCL filters and other passive filters such as using a smaller inductor and capacitors and L and LCL LC filters create faster dynamics for the system, create better total harmonic distortion or THD, reduce dependence on network impedance, change disadvantages of LCL filters such as complex design for optimized uh, parameters, need to resonance control. Some control techniques for control the VSI connected to the grid by LCL filter advantage and disadvantage of one of them. Proportional integral or PI controller to main drawbacks inability to track a sinusoidal reference without tracking error and poor disturbance ejection capability. Proportional resonance uh, or PR control strategies overall control simplicity disadvantage double loop scheme its requirement for a phase looped loop or PL or other complex current phase observers needed for generating the current reference to be fed to the inner control loop repetitive control strategies and dead bit control strategies have a good performance just in steady state one cycle control or OCC strategy good dynamic response robustness and good regulation properties in a wide range of operating conditions Designing an optimized LCL filter by an artificial intelligence technique named Particle Swarm Optimization or PSO. Recently, 
artificial intelligence has become a popular search technique used in computing to find exact or approximate solution to optimization and search problem. The particle swarm optimization is proved to an effective optimal arithmetic within is a novel kind of global optimization. This paper designed the parameters of LCL filter by particle swarm optimization algorithm. This method needs the following information. The particles of particle swarm optimization can be considered a set of three dimensional vector including uh, inductor inside of grid inductor inside of inverter and capacitor the last term of the vectors is fitness of the particle fitness function the total harmonic distortion or THD of AC side line current to achieve good filter effort a low THD current is required in accordance with uh, references 12 and uh, 11 LCL filter parameter range, range are in accordance with the following formulas PSO algorithm rain use their position and velocity to search the whole state space by following uh, formula by applying these cases in the PSO algorithm in the form of flowchart with creating link between M file of PSO algorithm and simulink in MATLAB contain information of the simulation filter parameters is extracted nominal values of the system and LCL parameters extracted by PSO algorithm are illustrated in this table. As shown in both diagram, LCL filter creates a resonance frequency in 1.5 kHz. Control grid connected inverter with LCL filter using OCC method. Advantage of OCC method including simplicity of control circuit and no need for linear controllers fixed switching frequency and reduction of switching losses no need for accurate system and inverter models no need for PLL or similar system to detect phase fast dynamics due to the use of only one control loop according to the reference 13 switching cycle average model is extracted as this figure the detailed equation on the left shows the relationship between input and output voltage according to the description uh, of the paper finally the equation on the right is obtained from equation on the left also values of parameters are mentioned in the paper implementation of the OCC circuit is shown as the right figure a resonance point is introduced due to the inherent characteristic of the L control the reactive power using virtual inductance uh, optimal control of active and reactive powers and voltage compensation by combining cases mentioned in the previous of the slides in the up equation this equation becomes the down equation and the new black diagram of the one cycle control core with active and reactive power control line with resonance control of LCL is shown in the right in corner figure In this slide, a uh, single phase equivalent of a uh, grid connected inverter with the LCL filter and new OCC core and reactive power controller are shown in a general view. Simulation results. Uh, 
The MATLAB software is used for simulation of the system under study, as shown in this slide. The computational simulations are performed to analyze under different generation condition the profile of the active and reactive powers. They have been investigated in the next five slides. In this case, damping isn't applied until 0.1 second. The THD has been upper 10%. After applying damping in the system, the grid current status has been uh, improved and damping is done very well. Uh, results obtained for stable operation condition are illustrated in these figures. While the voltage is in normal condition and maximum output uh, power of photovoltaic module is available. In this case, the THD is less than 1.5%. Uh, in this case, the effect of radiation chains on power and grid current has been investigated. In all radiation conditions, the THD is less than 1.6% and this ceiling voltage level changes slightly. In condition of a voltage change from 1 to 1.15 per unit and maximum output power of photovoltaic modules inverter has absorbed 10 kW reactive power. In down figure, active power is zero and the inverter can offer all its capacity to absorb their active power while it compensates the voltage of grid as shown in top figure on the right. In this case, the THD is 1.8%. In condition of voltage drop uh, from 1 to 0 0.85 per unit, maximum output power of photovoltaic module inverter has produced 10 kW reactive power. In down figure, active power is 0 and the inverter is offered all its capacity to supply the reactive power while it compensates the voltage of grid as shown in top figure on the right in this case the THD is 1.6 percent conclusion of this paper simplicity of control system and non-use of linear controllers in the core of OSIS control fix switching frequency and reduce switching losses. No need for PLL or similar system and easier control circuit. Stability and performance resistance to grid and PV system changes. Simultaneous control of active and reactive power and optimal tracking of power reference values. Voltage control at the point of common coupling with the network through the exchange of reactive power between the inverter and the grid. Uh, suggestions to continue this topic. Implement a new method to control reactive power with the OCC method. Implement other active damping methods to control the resonance of the LCL filter on, on the studied system. Use of different stru structure of multi-level voltage inverter instead of full bridge voltage source inverter for grid connected inverter by LCL filter. In order to answer to this question, I should uh, respond that in a passive damping method, a physical resistor is added to the LCL filter. It has some disadvantages such as larger filter volume causing power losses and need to a cooling system also active damping method needs a current sensor for detection of capacitor current of LCL filter regarding to these cases the implementation costs of the passive damping method are more than active damping method Thank you for your attention.